Well, it's Saturday the 21st of April 2018, 06.42 British summer time. It is summer. I know it's already spring, but it is summer. Lovely and warm. There's supposed to be thunderstorms this afternoon, but they seem to be off. It's going to be 20, which for us is like some sort of miracle. It's nicely cool at the moment. Here's the plan. Coffee, Malcolm up hill, and then this, I can't think, is it the Velvety Owls place that's supposed to be today? Somewhere on the Ponte Guindy Industrial Estate. So I'm going to have a little look at that. I have a feeling it's just lines. And there's my bus stop. By the way, good mood. Who'd have thought? Um, big shout out to Tiny Velma. Fueling update. 120.7 and 121.7. Doing a touch of the Asdas there. They always end in 0.7. Flags are still on the castle. It is warming up. I think I need a bacon roll. There's something happening. And the sun's out. And we're off. Sheltering from the sun. Nice white balance. This is golden mute. And it is golden. Yeah, from Elwood's. 4.1% out the whole by volume. Uh, a big shout out to people on Eastern Time. Mm. Light, refreshing. There's a hint of citrus. Nice, gentle, bitter finish. B plus and a bit. I must stop making silly phrases like that. Ah, Mr. Manning. We're moving on, the soon to be in another job, Mr. Manning. Look at the quality of this carpet. And look at the quality of this. This is Shauna Key Stout. I'm sure Shauna Key is famous for something. I should Google it or Bing it, maybe. 5% alcohol by volume from Wickwar Wessex Brewing Co. Wessex? Mm. Rich ruby stout on a sunny day. Mm. It's like aroma. That's nothing more to do with my nose than anything else. Mm. Rich, full body, fruity. More malty than uh, burnt notes. Slightly. Bitter finish. Um, B plus. There you are. I made a decision. You can probably tell it's not quite a sunny outside. Um, look at the white balance. Anyway, a quick can of half maker. It's a little bit cold. So I let it warm up. Probably by then it'll be time to wander down to Velvet Owl. I think it is lines. All very complex. Anyway, they do great beers. Well, as does a beating Morrison's on the fuel front. Maybe one penny. But one penny is what we need. And it's gone on the petrol. Up ahead. You see the bunting. That's the part of the industrial estate, which means I'm nearly dead. Well, hippies use the side door, you can't argue with that. This is the new Velvet Owl tap room, and so far I'm exceedingly impressed. Um, so, first beer from Velvet Owl is Dina Land, D I D N A E Land, Speyside. In Scotland, barrel age session milk stout. Only 3%, but wow, is it wonderful! Smells great. Actually, it's, that's a B. I 
and um, eco keg glass. It's a great day. So the plan is they open every Friday and Saturday, and at the end of each month, a sort of pipes like do food, weather permitting, and some rather wonderful ales. This is Moll's Medicine, uh, a lavender stout, lavender milk stout. Sorry, 3.6% alcohol by volume. <sighs> Exceedingly drinkable. Rather excellent. Mr. Manning, they have carpet. This is great. And uh, a selection of books. Mm. Coffee. Oh. Yep. That's another B. <laughs> really, really rather good. Number three, he says, Flaming Youth. Oh, I'm not going to take them. Velvet and Oil, Rowing Company. 4.7% alcohol by volume. A smoked, and it's very nice. A smoked brown ale. Nice to see the. Hmm. Nice aroma. Nicely smoked, not overly smoked. And a nice bitter, smoky finish. B plus plus. It goes on. It's good. And I think the sun is trying to come out, but as usual, failing. Not only great beers, but great people. This is Rocket Skate. Still stop, you've got to get rid of. Um, Chipotle Rye Porter at 5.2%. Um, not overly hot. And the sun's come out. Look, sun, sky, blue nurse. But nicely hot. I have to be honest, these boys know what they're talking about. More importantly, they brew wonderful beers. This is a B. Wow. Oh, we need some locals. Mind you, they're open every Saturday from now on, so unfortunately, next week is Lolfest, or fortunately, or, or whatever. And they know Gaza. Where are you, Gaza? This is great for Kefili. From Track Brewing in Manchester. This is Skyway at double IPA, 9% alcohol by volume. And the sun is out. Look at that. No, it doesn't matter. Ooh. Sound. Oh, this smells. Kind of wonderful. Oh wow. <laughs> Sharp. No, so yeah, Hint of alcohol. Uh, Maybe at nine percent. About three years now. Is it my right thinking you both used to work as tank? Is that right? Or yeah, so that's a B plus plus. And it is um, really good. After leaving the tons and I 